So guys, for the first step, you want to get to this screen. Now to get to this screen, you want to turn off your computer from the power button and then turn it back on again. Once you turn it back on again, you're going to see the Windows Zone screen. Now once you see the Windows Zone screen, you want to turn off your computer and then turn it back on again. Repeat this three times and then it will bring you to here. It's going to say that your PC did not start correctly, you want to click on Advanced Options, which will then bring us into here. Now you want to click on Troubleshoot, Advanced Options, and now once we're here, we have a couple recovery options. So for the first method, you want to look for System Restore. If you do not see System Restore, you want to click on See More Recovery Options, and then it should appear right here. But for me, I have it right here, so I'm going to click on System Restore. And if you have a Restore Point, you want to click on Next, and then stick to your Restore Point, and then click on Next again, and then click on Finish, which will take you back to your Restore Point. If you do not have a restore point, that's fine. We're going to be going to the next method. So you're going to click on cancel, click on troubleshoot, advanced options, and now we're back here again. And now once you're back here, you're going to look for start to repair. You're going to click on it. Now it's going to diagnose your PC. Let's see if it fixes your problem. If that did not fix your problem, that's fine. We're going to click on advanced options again, and then click on troubleshoot, advanced options, and now we're going to click on command prompt. Now we have some commands we need to type in. So for the first command, it's going to be C colon, click on enter. Now we're going to type in cd space backslash windows backslash system32 backslash config. Click on enter. Now we're going to type in md space backup. Click on enter. I already have it, so that's why it says this for me, but in your case it should be working. And now you want to type in copy space star dot star space backup. Click on enter. And now you want to type in a, which means all, and then click on OK. And now you want to type in cd space regback. Click on enter. And now you want to type in copy space star dot star space dot dot and click on enter. And now you want to type in a and click on enter again. And now you want to close this out and then click on continue to Windows. See if that fixes your problem. If that's still not working, you want to click on troubleshoot and then click on reset this PC. You want to make sure you have your important files backed up and then you want to choose which option that you want to go with. You could either keep my files, which removes apps and settings but keeps your personal files, or you could just remove everything. For me personally, if you have everything backed up, you can go over everything, and if you don't, you're going to click on keep my files. And then you should want to reset your PC, and then that should fix your problem. 